Welcome to Living Fearless, the podcast where we explore the limitless possibilities of fearless living and personal growth. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to the podcast of Living Fearless. I am your host, Lester Gonzalez, and today I want to delve into a topic that resonates deeply within the Stoic teachings. I really love talking about Stoicism because it really fits the niche within my podcast of Living Fearless. You know, with everything we go through in life, the challenges, the setbacks, it's just about moving forward from it seeing them as just an opportunity to grow and not being brought down because of these difficulties. But for today's topic, I really want to focus on stoicism, but how it correlates with gratitude. Not only that, but I want to help you understand the importance of building gratitude as a pathway to contentment and inner peace within our lives. You see, gratitude is a timeless virtue that lies in the heart of Stoic philosophy. The Stoic philosophers recognize the transformative power of gratitude in fostering a sense of contentment, inner peace, and fulfillment. And in a world filled with distractions and desires, building gratitude allows us to pause, reflect, and appreciate the blessings that surround us each day. One of the key teachings in Stoicism is the practice of focusing on what is within our control, the thoughts attitudes, and perceptions that shape our experience of the world. While we may not always have control over external circumstances, we have absolute control over our internal responses and attitudes. And by shifting our focus from what we lack to what we have been given, we have been able to build a sense or a spirit of gratitude that is able to transcend our joy and contentment in life. But moreover, Stoicism just teaches us the importance of embracing the present moment and finding beauty in the meaning in the here and now. Do not indulge in the dreams of having what you have not, but reckon up the chief of blessings you do possess and be thankful of everything that you have and what is yours currently now. And by practicing gratitude for the present moment and the blessings that surround us, we can find peace and contentment in the midst of life challenges and uncertainties. You see, when you live in the present moment, you don't overthink of what is ahead. You don't look back on the past, right? Each and every day is a is a blessing, right? There is no time to waste or no time to waste on dwelling on things that don't matter, right? You're just wasting time. You are running your time, right? And living in the present allows you to just allows you to stay focused and help you achieve what you can achieve now, right? Some things are out of our control, but living in the present allows us to see past that, okay? But additionally, Stoicism encourages us to build an attitude of acceptance. This goes back to why I believe Stoicism is crucial. It's because of accepting adversity, Right, accepting these uncertain challenges and setbacks. Rather than dwelling on what we lack or what has gone wrong, Stoic, Stoics advocate for embracing life as it is and finding gratitude even in the midst of difficulties. You know, and practice gratitude in all circumstances in your life. There are many people out there who wish they could be in your position. Think of it that way, right? Maybe what you have now is some is something that someone may really want to have in their future. You know, think of what you have now. Be thankful that you are alive and healthy. From for me, I I truly believe, you know, our health and happiness and well being is more important than having everything we can in life, right? And just us being alive today is already something we should be grateful for. And just to be thankful that we are alive and we are living in the present moment. And with that, we can find strength, resilience, and a peace of mind no matter what life may bring. This is a Stoic's mind, right? And overall, just Stoicism offers us a timeless wisdom of building gratitude and finding contentment in the present moment. And by shifting our focus from what we lack to what we have been giving, 
you know, everything I've went through, embracing the present moment, finding acceptance, we experience the transformative power of gratitude in our lives. So remember, my dear listeners, that gratitude is not just a fleeting emotion, but a way of life, a practice that can bring us joy, fulfillment, and a peace of our hearts. And may you embrace the practice of gratitude and find contentment in the blessings that surround you each day. So this concludes today's episode of Stoicism and Gratitude. Thank you guys so much for joining me of this journey of reflection, wisdom, and growth. Until next time, may you build a spirit of gratitude and find joy in the simple blessings of life. Be sure to follow this podcast for more self-help content, fearless, and stoicism. This is Lester Gonzalez signing out, and as always, my friends, have a blessed day.